What's up guys, this is Daniel with Midnight Movie Trash and I'm here with... Emily Perkins. Emily, tell me a little bit about your work on Ginger Snaps, the yeah. trilogy. Okay, so Ginger Snaps um, is an interesting kind of coming of age story. So it's got a horror twist on a coming of age story and it's about two sisters and one of them is turning into a werewolf. And so the werewolf is kind of a metaphor for for the way that the, the male gaze in a patriarchy objectifies women's bodies and um, sort of constructs the female body as monstrous and female sexuality as monstrous. The second one in the series focuses a, a lot more on your character than yes. Ginger. Any memorable moments from that film? Um, yes, yeah, so in the second one, I got to do a ton of special effects makeup. And so in contrast to the first uh, Ginger Snaps movie where Ginger kind of becomes this very sexy werewolf, for my character Bridget, when she turns into a werewolf, it's very, like, horrific. <laughs> She is like she does not embrace it at all the way her sister does. She's fighting it to the nail, and so yeah, it's a bit of an ugly transformation for poor Bridget. But it was oh my gosh, it was so much fun to film and just to look in the mirror and see myself completely transformed because that's what acting is all about. It's about transformation, and you can't get a more extreme form of transformation than becoming a monster. Let me ask you, what got you into acting? Um, I started acting when I was when I was 10 years old. I was just super young and idealistic, and I saw this um, this stage production of Sotoko and the 1,000 Cranes, and it was about this little girl in Japan who was dying from um, the radioactive fallout from the bombs of Hiroshima. And I was like, oh my God, if everyone could see this, there would be no more war. So I was like, storytelling is just so important. And of course now, like I have a a broader understanding of like how storytelling can touch people's lives like it doesn't necessarily have to be a, st a story about war but it could be about you know anything any kind of anything that makes us see life from someone else's perspective um, including including the horror genre yeah let me ask you how are you enjoying the first night of Houston Horror Film Fest I am just loving being here in Houston it is very warm but it's awesome. Like the vibe is just, it's so positive. It's so good. Everyone's just excited to be here. And yeah, it's amazing. Awesome. One final question. Where can they find you on social media? Um, I don't actually do social, social media, media really. <laughs> Sorry. No, I, I totally understand. <laughs> awesome. Well, thank you so much. Thank you very much. This is Daniel with Midnight Movie Trash. See ya.